give a big round of applause for your Bulls Youth Dance Team. During that break, Eric Spolster had some words for his team. And he's pushing them to empty the tank. He said, I know you're tired and it's been a tough game, but you can't hold back. If you're tired, come out. Otherwise, I want you full speed. Guys? All right, thank you, David. So with Drexler sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolster has on the floor. Paul George is out there with Walton. Then it's Damian Lillard. Then there's Devin Booker. And it's Eaton in at the five. Yeah, quick thinking, wins Dame, assists. Finds the open man, and the ball instantly there for the finish. Back to Jokic. Over to the wing. Down low. In transition, here comes Miami. And Wolpo throws it down. You gotta take care of the ball. They'll punish you if you're that careless. That's right, and that's severe punishment right there. The important two points, not just on the scoreboard, but also for a little bit of momentum. Booker, it's deflected. Pass to Novak. Here's the three. The shot's good on the assist by Vucevic. Vucevic has got three assists tonight. And now we'll get perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Bulls. Booker finds Lillard. Here's Eaton. Back to Lillard. The train. Vucevic with the rebound. Having a hand up in your face makes such a difference to a shooter. Yeah, that's a good defender making a play, and he does it without foul. Here's Novak, and it's sent back by George. Few players have a bigger impact defensively than Paul George. A, a fixture on the all-defensive team. PG, a nightmare for opponents. Stolen by Stojakovic. And here's the fast break. Jokic leading the way. Puts it up from 15. And the Bulls tag on two more. And when they've gone to him, he has come through big time. You got to keep getting him touches. And that one's good, Damian Lillard. Lillard. And if you look at the stats for unassisted jump shot percentage, well, Lillard is always around the top. He can drain those pull-up jumpers as well as anybody in our league. Fall. It's hauled in by the Heat. The pass to George. Back to Lillard. And the layup falls. Lillard. Oh, just a two-point Chicago lead. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Vucevic against Lillard. Fall passes to Vucevic. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Vucevic has got his first bucket of the night. The assist totals have just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Proof positive that Lillard is worthy. That's talent you can build a franchise around. And it's Vucevic in the corner. Another three for Chicago. Look at that shot. Vucevic not afraid to carry the weight, so to speak. And in a tough situation, the team knows they can rely on him. Timeout called the Heat. to present the New Balance player of the game, Shaq. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. And that has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. And that replay showed just how forceful that block was. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. Morant kicks the shot back to Morant. Kicks it out to Garnett. It's tipped. It's stolen by Abdul Jabbar. Two minutes remaining in the Curry on the wing. Two minutes. Misses it to Malone. A three from Drexler. 
Ja Morant grabs the rebound. The Bulls leading by five. It falls for his seventh bucket of the contest. He is seven for nine. What I love about Morant is that he understands his strengths on offense, which is why he is so efficient. Up top, Kobe. Pass to fall. And McGrady comes to help. O'Neal passes to Bryant. Five to shoot. Here's Fall. Back to Shaq. The Bulls need to get a shot off. Plenty of daylight on that shot. And now a 10-point Bulls lead. Well, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. I think when you've got it going from three-point range, you've got to keep it going. It's a good way to kind of pile up the points quickly. It works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. To the paint. Here's Kobe. And it looks like just playing the last bit of this one out in what should be a nice win here for the book. The differential in assists led to a lot of open looks and also helped to get uh, you know, more guys involved in the offense easy. And they made the defense adjust, but they just couldn't come up with an answer. And it'll go down as their first official win of the new year. And this will be their third win in three tries against these guys. They match up so well. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And, and look at the stats just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for John Morant. He came up with a bucket every time they needed him to. Great effort on offense, and he was a difference maker. Garnett finds Bryant, and he drops it in from the low post. And the Bulls lead by nine. And it's just competing. I mean, you know, giving your best when it matters most. And let me tell you, as a team, you love to hit your stride right at the crucial moments. They put this game away in style. They made the most of their opportunities looking comfortable and locked in throughout the night. You have to love their effort. This game wasn't handed to them. They took it. And so Chicago takes this one and by a big margin. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, I love the way they executed on both ends of the floor, completely under control for the vast majority of the game. And whenever there was a misstep, they just didn't allow it to fester, and that's why they're going to walk away with the win. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Kevin, thanks. Trey, leadership is such a key part of that point guard position, so what do you focus on with that? I'm a big guy and good in team chemistry, so any, any chance I can, go bowling, hang out with these guys, build chemistry, and uh, I think that's where it starts with the court, but that translates on. Yeah, you guys look like a tight-knit group right now, man. Congrats on the win. Kevin? David, thank you as always. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.